Are you looking for that great little pocket express cruiser that you can load on a trailer and take it anywhere? Well then come with me for a quick tour on Not On Call. This is a 2006 Maxim 2600 SE express cruiser, well powered with a perk cruiser 350 mag. She comes with a trailer, air conditioning, inverter, full enclosure, ready to go, ready to rock and roll. So load her up and take her home with you. Here we are starting off starboard side on this 2007 Maxim 2600 cruiser. We see we've got some nice lines, stainless steel rub rail, white hull, and a black, we're going to call that the bootstripe, though it's a little bit high. Notice stainless steel port lights. Maxim did a nice job on this boat. We've got a higher railing, no bow pulpit to pay extra footage in the marina, no windlass, but the anchor locker is covered, and we've got a nighttime spotlight right there. This deck has what I call an LLI, ladies like it feature. Just get a sun pad made, put it out there, and lay out and enjoy the day. Coming down along the side, we've got our tinted windshield right there, VHF antenna. We do have a full enclosure on this vessel. The front windows are the firm Macrolon, nice and clear. And then the side is Eisenglass. And we've got a canvas back here to enclose it. Let's step aboard. Once aboard, not on call, this 2600 Maxim SE Express Cruiser. We see we have lots of features right here. Now this extended swim platform is large enough for either a dinghy or put a couple deck chairs out here and enjoy the view. As we enter the vessel, we see we have our hot and cold shower right there. And then right in front of us, we've got this oversized transom bench seat, which actually lays down and becomes a sun pad. To starboard, we have storage right there. Nice little step, makes an additional seat. Wet bar here with refrigerator. We've got a double wide helm seat for both you and a friend. That also swivels, so when facing aft, you're part of the conversation. Here at the helm, we've got our tilt steering wheel stainless steel bezel gauges, compass, Mercury Smartcraft, Navman Tracker GPS, VHF radio, and the biggest and best feature is this bow thruster. Yes, bow thruster on this 26 footer, so you can easily dock it. Circling around, we have that cocktail table, which also can be lowered for a large sun pad area. We've got an LLI, ladies like it, chaise seat right here. The cockpit is nice, wide open for lots of folks and entertainment. Engine access is nice and easy with the flip of a switch. Up it comes. Moving in closer, we see the Merc Cruiser 350 Mag MPI. Looks like the risers and manifolds have been changed. Non-original. Off in the corner, we've got four batteries. This vessel is raw water cooled with about 160 engine hours on her. Engine space is organized. There is some signs of leakage over here. Looks like previous damage. That's why people would have changed the risers and manifolds. After that quick little inspection, again, with the touch of a button, down we go.
Access to the foredeck is nice and easy. Just close that door and use those solid fiberglass steps up, up, through the window, and out to the foredeck to lay out in the sun. While we're at it, behind there, we have a nice lockable screen door to allow more air and light into the cabin. From here, let's go inside. We enter the cabin through this sliding center line door and down a few steps. This gives us an overview of the cabin interior. And then immediately to our right, we have easy access to our power panel, stereo, DVD player, our inverter panels right there. We've got a nice galley with cabinet storage up above, Corian countertop, single burner stove, refrigerator and cabinet storage off to one side. As we move forward, we see we've got some nice side port lights and an overhead hatch again for light and air. This table can be lowered for yet another sleeping area and you could comfortably put four adults around there. One feature which I know you can't see is the air conditioning in the cabin. Maxim did a really nice job on this boat. We have fully lined vinyl, full owner's packet, nice vinyl seating here. And of course, there's our thermostat. To con it's a heat pump for air and heat. As we pull back, we've got our head right here, fully lined fiberglass, we have a freshwater toilet flush right there and a pull-out shower. As we circle around, in these steps, we've got our trash storage right there, more storage in the second one. And then as we move aft, we have a double wide mid cabin right there. You can see it's over four feet wide there's storage behind the headboard and it goes full beam all the way back we do have a privacy curtain nice decor on this vessel neutral simple elegant let's not forget our tv and most importantly besides the bow thruster it comes with a tandem axle galvanized trailer viewer today owner tomorrow this is Lou speaking enjoy the water